play. Is uh, she ready? She is ready. Golly, well then. Uh, this is a show where we have mostly people that somebody may know once in a while, some people that people may not know, but this is a person that everybody is getting to know. Please welcome Miss Sarah Bernhardt, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Sandra. For, for those of you who can speak, which is fascinating. Now, I feel so good to be back on Sunset. It really is. I just turned 10, 15 tricks. I feel great. I really do. I relaxed right into the evening. Now, I feel like a mole on Marilyn Monroe's face. I'm just happy to be here tonight. I really am. I'm thrilled. Because tonight we're going to party like it's 1999. Everybody go, party. <laughs> it's great. I just came from my first aerobics class, which I hated. And I'll never do it again. The woman who was leading the class, not only did she jump, play the tambourine, dance, but the bitch sang at the same time. <laughs> I said, please shut this woman up before I murder her. What's your name? <laughs> Who's your daddy? What is your name? Ace? Hi, Ace. I like everything about you. I like the fashion risk you took tonight, Ace. <laughs> By combining two completely different colored velveteens. It's outrageous. I love it. And stack those heels, goddammit, Ace. <laughs> I like you, I like you a lot. I like you, and yet I'd like to hurt you. <laughs> I'd like to smack your fucking beard off, mister. <laughs> I'd like to make your life miserable tonight. I feel very open with you. I feel very close. I feel very vulnerable, Ace. I want to share things with you. I want to show you things. I want to show you my breasts, and yet I'm frightened. I don't know what it is. <laughs> and they are so big tonight, they're scaring me. They are huge. I'll take my jacket off. I know. When I drove over from the valley tonight, I had to pull over three or four times just to let them rest. <laughs> <laughs> they're very exciting. They're firm, fresh, and fun to look at. And I'm touching them right now, and it's very, very exciting. <laughs> Can I throw my... You take care of that? No, she'll take better care of it. I know that. Tonight I'm wearing a very fashionable front fasten John Claus Frazier. Very shiny, very reflective. With just a hint of lace, a scandalous hint of lace. Enough lace to bring you to your knees, Ace. I'm begging for more. My nipples aren't hard right now, but I promise before the end of the evening they will be. I'm working on a groovy thing. Would you like to have your nipples played with, Ace? I bet you do. I bet you liked it so much you took a Black & Decker and just sanded them right off. <laughs> Felt a little bit too goddamn good, didn't it, Ace? Play with them. Touch them. See, men are obsessed with women's nipples. They'll just play with them for hours. You can be asleep and they'll still be at it. You know, <laughs> understand that there's a very fine line between eroticism and nausea. <laughs> it's like, if you don't stop playing with my nipples, I'm going to throw up. Please. <laughs> Touch them briefly, fuck me, and go home. 